EastEnders Chelsea Fox returned to the square in 2020 as a troublemaker involved with drug smuggling, but she has since stopped her criminal ways and settled into life in Woolford. An express.go.uk theory explores why she might revert back to her dangerous ways. Chelsea, played by Zaria Abrahams, has been recovering from her trauma after finally escaping abusive murderer Gray Atkins, Tony Alexander-Smith, who is now in prison. The EastEnders' favourite has been struggling to leave her mother's house and go back to the home she once shared with Gray though, feeling haunted by what happened there. However, Official spoilers from the BBC soap confirm she will soon be at risk of losing the house, and desperate to secure a stable future for Jordan, Chelsea might go to extreme lengths to try to keep it. In upcoming episodes, Chelsea tells housemate Whitney Dean, Shona Magati, about Patrick Truman's, Rudolf Walker, offer to house swap. This was first indicated in Thursday's episode when Patrick watched Chelsea rowing with Kim Fox, Tamika Empson over their living arrangements. Kim argued Chelsea is lucky to have such a nice home that she was once going to live in with her husband. If you like it so much, why don't you live there? Chelsea suggested. Patrick looked as though he was considering the idea so Chelsea won't have to relive her traumatic experiences. In future scenes, Chelsea is unsure if she should go through with the swap, contemplating Patrick's offer. Kim is delighted by the news but she is disappointed when Chelsea has a boost of confidence and decides to stay where she is. Chelsea's happiness doesn't last very long though, as Whitney soon finds a letter involving Gray. It states he hasn't paid the mortgage for months, which means the friends could lose the house. Eager to help keep the property, Kim steps in to support her niece. She offers to assist with managing the money and Chelsea accepts her help. At Ruby's, Kim begins crunching the numbers while Chelsea decides to help out Dottie Cotton, Millie Zero, who is understaffed and stressed. Impressed by Chelsea's work, Kim and Whitney urge her to take a job at the club. Offended by the idea, Chelsea storms out. However, when she gets home, her mother Denise Fox, Diane Parrish, shares some words of wisdom that make her reconsider. If Chelsea does take a job at the bar though, she may be tempted to go back to her old ways of making quick money. She could become so desperate to protect Jordan that she decides to steal from the business. If she does, this will probably be picked up by Eagle Eye Dottie, who isn't likely to forgive Chelsea. Dottie might decide to fire Chelsea, and if word gets around about her thieving, she will struggle to find another job locally. Already lured back into her old ways, Chelsea might take things a step further and get back in touch with her old contacts who were involved in selling drugs. When she arrived back on the square after years away, Chelsea was indebted to her boyfriend Caleb Malone, Ben Freeman, after embarking on a relationship with him. She soon decided to get back in touch with her estranged father Lucas Johnson, Don Gile, so she could use him to smuggle drugs for Caleb. When Chelsea couldn't find a way out, Denise reluctantly agreed to help her blame Lucas. Later, after agreeing to help Chelsea, Lucas had a change of heart and was arrested, but left Chelsea out of it. Wanting to put an end to it all, Chelsea then tipped the police off about Caleb and he was also arrested. Since then, Chelsea has turned her lifestyle around, but with her recent experiences and new desperation for money, could she get back in touch with some of the people she used to know? It's possible that, in her vulnerable state, Chelsea may think her only option is to get involved in drug selling again. Although she has her family in Woolford, their home is crowded and probably doesn't have enough space for a baby, and Chelsea is determined to give Jordan the best life he can have. She even contemplated putting him up for adoption because she believed she wouldn't be good enough for him. Will someone find out about Chelsea's plans before she takes it too far? Perhaps Whitney will notice Chelsea has been acting strangely and catch on. But will Chelsea listen to Whitney if she tries to discourage her from going ahead with the plan?